Hello, it's Inspector Godfrey here. Uh, had a call about a sheep stuck underneath the M40 motorway by a railway. Uh, I was 50 miles away at the time, so I've driven straight at the M40. Uh, managed to pull over, hence the noise. Um, and this is what I found. I don't know if you can see that fella over there, or you probably, just on the on the bank. It looks like it's completely trapped, uh, the wrong side of the fence. I don't know what is going to get that out, to be honest. Uh, he doesn't look in any distress, chewing the cud. Got a bit of a grey muzzle as well, so <laughs> he's probably been around a little while. Let's see if I can get down a bit closer to her. I wonder if he just enjoys the view of watching trains, the train spotter. The path goes right down here and it appears to go around the corner there. So that's a, a dead end with a fence there. But I'm going to find out what's around underneath that bridge. What do we have? Almost looks like a small crop field. Oh, there's some horses over there. It looks a bit like an American ranch. Well, I mean, There's vegetables growing here, some sort of a pipe perhaps for irrigation, and some, uh, well it's very strange, very very strange. I've got no idea what this place is, it's like some sort of big ranch, big open spaces, there's very strange buildings in the distance, um, I mean there's a few other animals here, they all seem okay, I'm going to go back and make sure that I have missed something that the sheep has got water. Maybe that's where he's kept. Um, I mean, he seems all right, but we've got to make sure. But it's, this is a very, very strange call. Sheep have ear tags, as, as do cattle and things like that. Um, all these numbers, are, the ear tag numbers are recorded on a database, which trading standards have access to. So ideally we can contact them and they can try and get hold of the owner and find out who owns the sheep, make sure it's all right, or if it needs to uh, taken back to them. Close enough now, I've got his ear tag number, that's great, I'm happy with that. Uh, looking over him, he's in good health, he's clearly old as I say, uh, with a body to go with, he's got good hooves, he's recently been shorn by the looks of things. Um, so, I mean, I'm not particularly worried about him really, I, I actually, after my little walk around, I think he quite simply likes being up here, if perhaps a little bit lonely, but maybe he's earned that right. Uh, in his old age. So I just had a really pleasant phone conversation with the owner of the sheep. Uh, they explained that he got away when they were rounding up the rest of them. Um, they're not sure yet whether they're going to round him up and bring him with the others because he seems really happy up, up on that uh, up on that ledge there. Train spotting in this case. Uh, he's got a friend in a, in a horse that's there as well so he's got company and he can access all of that big large field. So yeah, a very strange job but one that worked out alright. <coughs>